what the hell is a tactical pen? You wouldn't believe how many times I get that question. And not just for pens, but pretty much anything with the word tactical in it. And as you could tell in today's market, everything seems to have the word tactical in front of it. Well, my simple answer for what the hell is a tactical pen is, it is a pen that is built with certain tactical purposes in mind and can hold up to those demands that are put upon it. So once again, that's a simple explanation, but let's get into more detail on what the hell is a tactical pen. So what are some of the purposes for carrying a tactical pen? For me, there's two main purposes uh, for carrying a tactical pen. And first being self-defense. The second reason being for rescue situations. Uh, being able to use the business end or the glass breaker end to be able to perform a rescue, whether it's a person trapped in a car after an accident or even a pet. So some of the features that are common to a standard tactical pen. First off, they all write. They're all writing utensils. They're all ink pens. So why is that important? Well, it's important because, of course, the convenience of always having a pen on you, or additionally important, is the fact that you have an excuse for carrying, let's say, this uh, tool. And if you were to be scrutinized by law enforcement or anybody questioning you, you can basically say, yeah, it's a, it's a pen. I'm using it to write. Now, tactical pens are made of aircraft-grade aluminum or other durable construction. A thumb rest, which usually should feel good with or without gloves on. So once again, this is usually a go-to position for a tactical pen, uh, known as a reverse grip position, and being able to place your thumb on there to get that added uh, dexterity and being able to retain your tool that much better is also an important feature that you will find in most tactical pens. Business end or the glass breaker end, which is also referred to as the skull crusher end. And uh, once again, various applications, but this uh, business end is generally what will really distinguish a tactical pen from a standard pen. And the last common feature that I want to go over is uh, the fact that they fit ergonomically as far as their design into your hand. So it's comfortable, comfortable to retain, comfortable to utilize. So just that the way that they're designed and fit in your hand is also a feature of a tactical pen as opposed to other tools and pens that you will find out there on the market. Now a benefit that I want to go over uh, for carrying a tactical pen that really cannot be understated and to me is one of the main reasons why I choose to carry a tactical pen is because it can be uh, utilized when you travel, especially internationally. Now what do I mean by that? It can be carried virtually anywhere where other EDC or everyday carry items would be banned or even deemed unlawful, especially when you were traveling overseas. So once again, something that I could have with me on my person that has multiple benefits that we already had gone over, but also I can carry and feel much more comfortable, especially when I might not know the exact laws and operation of the place that I'm operating in, and knowing that, hey, worst case, I have a pen on me. And it's not uh, something that would be looked at as, uh, as uh, being utilized for lethal purposes, uh, such as a knife or such as a pistol or even retractable batons. So uh, keeping that in mind, to me, that benefit right there is enough reason for me to always have a tactical pen on me when I'm traveling. Now keep in mind that I just went over basic standard features that you'll find in most tactical pens, but tactical pens out there now come with so many different features that uh, you can almost refer to them as a multi-tool as opposed to just a tactical pen. I mean, things from flashlights to uh, uh, bottle openers to fire starters and pretty much anything else in between you'll start to be able to find on a tactical pen. Uh, once again, more features doesn't make it better, but it really depends on what you're utilizing it for. And features that might be useless to me will be relevant to you, and of course, vice versa. So this is more of a general uh, overview of what the hell is a tactical pen 
but keep in mind that there are many, many options and features in today's market when it does come to tactical pens. So bottom line, I've reviewed many tactical pens. Uh, some of my favorite are made by the Atomic Bear. You'll find uh, various reviews that I've done over the years uh, for their product line on my coachholder.com website if you are interested and want to get more specifics on certain models. But keep in mind to me, being able to travel with something that I can protect myself and have as a go-to tool, especially when operating uh, internationally or overseas or even in a different state, that I'm not 100% sure uh, what their laws and rules and regulations are, I know that I could always have my trusty tactical pen uh, in a pinch to be able to do something to better my cause, as opposed to nothing. Once again, this is Helder. I hope that you found this information useful.